the Lady Vols have had a perfect start to their season, a start that hasn't been seen in the program since the 2009 and 2010 season. For us to be 7-0, and you know, in the beginning, you know, not losing our first game, learning from last year, just going in and playing hard, um, it's just a great experience. I mean, I'm glad that we're 7-0 right now. It does give us a lot of confidence, but we're never, we're never going to be too satisfied. It's always work to be done. I mean, every day we come in the gym, we're trying to get better. You know, that's our main focus. We have a goal that we're trying to reach to, and that's to, to get to Nashville in April. And so, you know, every day we have to grind for that. Our motto this season is grind for nine. And so, you know, we're doing that every day we come in here. After snagging the Junkanoo Jam Champions title over the Thanksgiving weekend, the Lady Vols are back in Knoxville to prepare for their next opponent. Although the team has no marks in their loss column, head coach Holly Warlick says she's still waiting to see the team play a perfect 40-minute game defensively, and she's looking to see improvements in their zone offense. I think we got we got to get better against zones, and I think that's my fault. Uh, I don't think if we've spent a lot of time on our main offenses, a lot of time on our defenses, and uh, I think our, our zone offense has suffered. And so we've gone back to work and and put in a lot of time with it. So I, I hopefully will see a, a better result of us moving the ball and have player movement as well against the zone. Next up for the Lady Balls is longtime rival Texas. I think Texas has got one of their better teams they've had in a while. I think they've got a great backcourt in Fusel, and then um, their, their front court is big, they're physical, they play hard, and I think it's a different team than, than we've seen in the past couple of years. For more on the Lady Balls, be sure to check out Inside the Paint on Friday at utsports.com.